Ever wish you could kick your game up a notch without diving into the tech mumbo jumbo, making chrome cars? Well, today's the day. I'm about to expose a game guardian biggest secret that'll change your gaming life without messing with your phone. But before we dive in, a quick heads up. This video is strictly for educational purposes. We're here to explore ethical modding and creativity within games. Today, I'm excited to share an updated method for using Game Guardian, especially Android 13 and above. No root needed. Virtual Master is the key, creating an Android within your Android. Why the change? Traditional methods hit roadblocks, and this is a game changer for modding. Stick around, it's more effective, and an improvement from our previous methods. Now let's start modding. First of all, you're gonna need to click the link on my About page to download all of the needed resources. Now go ahead and click Download. Once you've downloaded the zip file, extract the file to your desired folder. Here, you'll see three files. If you haven't downloaded Game Guardian, open this file to get the download link. Copy and paste the link to your browser. Scroll to the bottom of the page until you see the purple button. Click on it and make sure you agree to the download terms. Next, return back to your file manager and install both Exposed Installer and Game Guardian. Now, what's left is Virtual Master. You can download this app for free on Google Play Store. The setup process will be a little bit complicated. Make sure to follow the steps carefully. Good news is, this has to be done just once. But before we do that, I want a bit of your time to hit the like and the subscribe button. Now let's open Virtual Master. If your device is Android 12 or above, you'll have to activate the app first. Just click Activate to start the process. First, connect to any Wi-Fi. I have mine connected already. Then you'll need to turn on the developer option too. If you don't know how to do that, just click on the question mark and read the instruction. I have mine turned on already. Next, we're gonna need to pair our device for a wireless debugging. Click on the pair your device button and allow all notification to be able to receive the code. Click on the button again. This time scroll to the bottom until you see wireless debugging. Click on it and click OK to allow wireless debugging on your network. Turn on debugging then click on pair device with pairing code to get the Wi-Fi pairing code. If you look on your notification, you will notice a notification from Virtual Master. Click on it and type the code you saw earlier. Now the final step is to return back to Virtual Master to activate your app. Click on Activate and you've activated your app. There's a few steps left to set up your apps for modding. Click on the Create VM button to create your virtual Android machine. We'll use Android 7 because that works the best for now. Choose any resolution, but I recommend 1080x1920. Click on Start VM. The first time will take a while, as the system will install the framework first. This is your second phone, inside your phone. Next, scroll up and click Add Files to add your app. Locate your F90 Master Tools folder and add Super User to your new Android. The app will ask if you want it to restart your device. You can go ahead and click Confirm. It won't take long anyways. Once that's done, you can repeat the steps to add Exposed Installer. Now click Add Apps to clone installed apps. Clone both Game Guardian and the app to mod. Now everything is pretty much done. What's left is to test if your apps is working properly. Open Game Guardian. 
click on the third option. Now Game Guardian will automatically install itself and delete the installer. Open Game Guardian again and click Start. You should see a shield icon floating on your screen. Now open your game. If you see your game on the process list, that's mean you can mod your game now. Let's make another test by making a Chrome car. Our car has turned to Chrome, which means our app is working properly. So, that is all for today, my friends. I wish you a happy modding. Remember to keep it ethical. If this video has helped you, please hit the like button and subscribe. That'll help me to make more videos in the future. Also, please check out this video too. See you again soon. Prince F90, signing out.